No, 2080. 2080. Yeah, that's it. Drive it, check it out, and I'll get you our outdoor number, Alan. Okay. Okay. I done hit the go live button and didn't even know it. Sometimes the devil one is trying to hit me. So, we got good oil pressure, it's charging, alternator's charging, temperature seems good, 151,000 miles, four wheel drive, Sunroof. <laughs> Don't need a sunroof. Seats look like they're in good shape. All right, what's going on? I'm getting me some air conditioning. I'm talking about wind. So I'm looking at, oh, I'm looking at some used trucks. I 
trying to see if old granddaddy, old granddaddy's running partner can come through. <laughs> Not corn dogs. So, So, so this guy that owns this dealer, this car lot, uh, him and my granddaddy was running partners. Like my granddaddy's, he's going to be with the Lord, but like they was best friends. They got into trouble together. So, <laughs> so what I'm saying is, it's like I wonder if he can like get right uh, with a used truck. Just looking. Never hurt to take a little test drive, did it? I can tell you one improvement already, the bandits. <laughs> Basically, here's one improvement already. Toyota. I like a Toyota myself. You know, I just got to have four-wheel drive, like, because of uh, hauling my camper and my boats, and, and I need a truck. Yes. Always got a backup camera. Like Ford, 
Dodge, Ford, Ford, Chevrolet, Nissan. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna make it through this. Let me get out. How much do you trust a backup camera? Not very good, if you're me. <laughs> I was riding with a woman one time that had the little lights and the mirrors. She's like, Oh, if that light's on, somebody's there. If it's not on, nobody's there. I was like, yeah, pull over. I'm going to relieve you of your duties now. <laughs> How about let me just go ahead and pass on that right quick. I know y'all... I know y'all feeling it too, but that air is like get, making stuff happen around him. Yee! Woo! Feel like a brand new. I feel brand new. That rejuv rejuvenates you. So him would go up. Uh, Oh, there's a Nissan, Chevrolet. Um, there's a Dodge, Ford, Chevrolet, another Ford, Chevrolet, Z71. I got a pretty front end. GMC. I didn't see that. There's a fold. Yeah. Oh, that got a winch on it. Help. Like, that's the real definition there. Help. There's a red one. Oh, what I'm talking about. Oh, look out now. I didn't see the van. <laughs> Uh, we all get in trouble. Oh, there's a boat. An uh, undertaker lift. Yeah, I don't, we don't need that. I'm on a pass. On the undertaker lift. What the world going on here? Uh, there's a fold before fold. Look at that. Yeah. All right, all right, yeah. That's smooth. Mm -hmm. That's nice. So, uh, does that van come with curtains? Uh, look, that, you look in there if you want to, look at your own risk. <laughs> so, yeah. 
man, we can actually have a conversation driving. I never can do that. So we just cruising here. Uh, oh, like your son's truck. I heard that. Hey, this thing rides smooth. This has got, it's still got good oil pressure. Alternator's charging. We ain't had to work on nothing. Trying it out, trying it out, you know. So somebody, uh, somebody look this up for me. Uh, the price of this truck. It's a 2014 four-wheel drive GMC Sierra. Um, 151,000 miles. Somebody look it up, see what it's even worth. I don't have a clue. Y'all want to do that? Somebody want to do that for me? Good morning. Oh, wait. Uh... Heck, I don't know, Brian. Fifteen hundred. It's a fifteen hundred Sierra four wheel drive GMC Sierra. Yeah, I said that much, didn't I? There's a truck. Y'all look that up that fast. Twenty-two K. Twenty-two. Wow, that just sank in. I was like, I was thinking like, what? Yeah, it sank in just then. Yeah. Between 22 and 25. <laughs> Spin a wheel. <laughs> totally kid. I would never. I 
I'm a child of God, I would never do that. I really would. <laughs> That's a lot for 150,000 miles. Let's see. That's a lot. Yeah. That's, that is a pretty good bit. Well, you know. don't have a misfire. It, there's no way. Oh, it's got to have tires. Like, there ain't no way. This is just a test drive, by the way. Somebody better find a phone charger. It's it's got some pep. Like if you gotta pull out in a hurry, like if like, like if you got, just say you ate some uh Taco Bell and you like twenty five minutes from home. That's an improvement. <laughs> Woo! I'm just saying, like, you know, there when you need it. That's a, that's, that's a fantastic idea. Where's the American version? There it is. There it is. Some maintenance log. Uh, yeah. That'll be a negative. What is this, a survival guide? Woohoo! That.
Man, nobody stuck some emergency cash in here. I was checking. Now that's good to do when you're out of town. Emergency. Well. All right, Alex, I'm going to phone a friend. This thing's like top of the line. It's, it's sunroof, heated seats, leather, four door, four wheel drive. My friend is. My friend is him. My friend is here. Somewhere. My friends with AS. Luke in my Texas, and Willie and the boys. The simple life I'm living got me feeling like the Hatfields and McCoys. Our own even love song. Blue eyes crying in the rain And that Luke and Mark, Texas God, okay. Man, y'all working, ain't you? Oh, it ain't mine. Oh, you got Yeah, it ain't mine. Man, you've been laying in it, ain't you? <laughs> you gonna have to donate that to the Goodwill. <laughs> Just another day at the office, ain't it? Look. At Look at Mr. New Boots down there. Can't tell him nothing. I mean, new boots and everything. <laughs> Man, y'all. I took out more bolts in like 30 seconds than he's taken out in the last 30 minutes. <laughs> Man, are y'all like stripping it or are you fixing it? I'm taking the motor out. I told him I was going to build it in the truck. He's not wrong. I got a brand new motor in that truck. Take that one out, put that one in here, and then put the transmission back in. Yeah. Man, y'all doing the big, the big dollar stuff. <laughs> I'm not getting no grease on you in that new DMC. I hear you. People that buy that kind of stuff, they, they get mad at you. No, you're just turning from a tractor. Why not? Like I was coming to get my 
I was coming to get my friend's opinion. Hey, the good news is it's got a brand stinking new alternator on it. I mean, <laughs> golly. Man, y'all both gonna have. The Fords are bleeding me dry. Let me back up and get this toolbox right here. What the heck? Dang, Hollywood, is that the biggest one you could find? <laughs> Hold on, I gotta look. What you got in there? It's pretty rough. Four, five sockets. Man, I didn't even know a drawer, a tool drawer exists that looked like that. I believe it. <laughs> yeah. You know what's that damn drawer way? Wow, yeah. Uh, my stuff's just threw in the back seat. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I didn't even know like this existed. Right, son. Yes. You got it clean and organized. It ain't clean. It's <laughs> very like Well, makes you funny, keeps you, you honest and makes you sleep good at night. That's what it was. You can't sleep the thing about it is, uh, <laughs> I don't know nobody nothing for. That's winning. That toolbox right there with no tools in it. I believe it. I like your sticker. Mean people suck. And no whining. Who'd you put that on there for? <laughs> he said he put that on there for him. That's a damn lie. That was put on there at that other shop. No, that was actually put on there when I had a fucking truck. That was on the truck. I mean, have you did a few brake jobs? That's what I was telling you when old boy and old Riley was going to tell me about some brakes. I've done that in like two weeks. Man, that is, so that's like, they stacked up in fours, so that's. There's 50-something brakes up there. And I thought I did a lot of brake work. Uh, you can take them to Atlanta. It was like 20 uh, $20. Everyone What's you think, Dollar? I wanted to show you. I was just right. test driving it. Hey, you well, look. Well, at least it is a GMC. That's a good thing. Yeah, the government built that. <laughs> it is four wheel drive. You don't have to say it. it. Sometimes it don't have to say it to impress. I get rid of that ugly toolbox on. Yes, it uh. <laughs> no, I'm. It's just a test drive. You ain't never been on a test drive. Oh, never. Mm -mm. Me neither. It's the first time. Hey, I bought that right there over the phone. I was at the race as close as she wanted it. I called my boy at Ford Place and told him I said, uh. You can get me a good interest rate, tank of fuel, call me when it's ready. When it's ready. Call me if you got it done with TD, all the uh, TD Ameritrade. That's winning. I think it back then was like 3.9. That's winning. Yeah, people would kill to have 3.9 now. Yep. Well. I just was gonna stop by and see y'all. I didn't know y'all was really you knee deep and yeah. in that thing. Yeah, it's it's pretty rough. Y'all got it going on. Oh, top water, top water. I threw. Yesterday I threw lures until I like about throw up. 
I was like, I've done everything but top water. The second top, five pounds. A little old bitty torpedo with one blade on the back, a white one. You know we're at the bridge by the DNR shack yep. where you lost that and I lost one right there that blew up that wet me. I was like, can't have nothing. Yep. Yes. <laughs> Let's see y'all. Yeah. Where at? Okay. Yes, sir. They built for mileage. Oh, this is 151,000. I didn't tell you. Yes, sir. That's winning. All right. That was cool hand Luke in Hollywood. <laughs> They funny to me. Holly, uh, cool hand looks funny. Must be nice riding around in a new GMC like it's not mine. And I've never bought nothing new. Nothing. Never. Nothing new. My whole entire life. This ain't new neither. <sighs> and it also is not mine. I'm just driving around in the AC. That's all. I can tell you this, I'm I'm way past. I'm way past this every time I get in a vehicle, I gotta work on it. Now, I ain't complaining. Trust me, like I've got very good at brakes, dry shafts, universal joints, alternators, carburetors, starters. But my goodness, like who has, who has that much trouble, you know? Great to have right here. So, in case y'all don't know, Hollywood is not a GMC Chevrolet man. He's a Ford man. He said I was trading. I was trader i was like i ain't did nothing you know i ain't did nothing it's good to see y'all today i apologize for being a little late i had breakfast 
with my coffee show, uh, my coffee show was a little late. So, I kind of don't know what I'm going to do with my life, you know? I mean, I know what I'm going to do. I know the direction I'm headed. But, and I owe y'all an apology, you know? hundred to pull it. Yeah, you do kind of got a point. I actually thought this was a 2500. Um, pull off the side of the road. Um, so I, I owe y'all an apology. Like, I talked to my daddy yesterday and we talked about an hour, and he's like, son, you monking up. I said, what? He said, you messing up. I said, what have I done? Like, I value my daddy's opinion a lot. A lot. Um, and my daddy's... full of wisdom and like they stuff that he'll take to the grave with him that I don't know still he's that smart and like he is a genius and I have realized like this trip is out of my wheelhouse but I still want to try it in four wheel drive I see you go to neutral shift in progress four wheel drive shift in progress four-wheel drive, so, yeah, I don't like that, because it, it ain't saying it's in four-wheel drive. I hear it in four wheel drive, but oh, it's definitely four wheel drive. All right, let me, but, but it mine shows four by four, like four by low, uh, low. Yeah, that's definitely two-wheel drive, but it's like, it don't have any, it don't have any kind of mojo. What the heck? What the heck was up with that? Trash and control off. Oh yeah, that's that's like what it was. Yeah, I was like something's wrong, but that yeah, I need to take that back off. Yeah, that that uh, well yeah, traction control was the problem. So I was kind of thinking like she didn't have no get up and go, but she did. She have a little get up and go. Are you kidding me? 
This is ridiculous. This is what people do. Come and throw their trash out. That's so stupid. Can't have nothing. I promise you, it ain't all country folks. making some kind of noise. I mean, what a ridiculous person to throw all that out here side the road. Somebody else got a pickup. Got baby diapers in it. Nothing against the baby, but that's ridiculous. That's just sorry. Man, the only thing about... Well, like Brian had a point about the 2500, but um, I have that diesel to pull the camper with. So... Technically, I don't know. I guess that's the point. I don't know myself, really. Well, yeah, it makes you wonder what their house looks like. Well, it's less a couple garbage bags. Actually, that was a bunch of garbage. That was, that was like a week's worth of stuff. You deserve a good truck, Stephen. You're spending a lot of money on vehicles. I, I really am. Like, the point of driving a paid off vehicle like I've had cheap vehicles my whole life. There's nothing wrong with that. There only time I spent like a lot of money on a vehicle was when I was married and my wife was driving like my kids around. You know, I made sure she had something nice. I I never really did. Uh, I didn't mind though. I don't mind the cheaper vehicles. I just got to have air conditioner and stuff you know that long as you got air conditioner you can make it i don't even want nothing new uh, i can't i can't handle it no i i mean i'm already eating turkey sandwiches <laughs> like could you imagine like having to buy a new truck on top of it Bologna, like it'll be like baloney. I like baloney too. Just saying, you just gotta put a tomato on it and a little salt and pepper. Uh, I know my repair bills on my vehicles is. A lot. I tell you what, I don't want to do. Uh, I tell you what, I don't want to do. I don't want to be buying another problem. That's what I don't want to do. squeaking or rattling and it rides pretty good like 
to have bald tires. Just me personally, if I was selling a vehicle, I would, it's just the way I think. Like, if I was trying to sell something and somebody come out and said, yeah, that tire on there could blow out any minute like you think you got the good out of it. Maybe that's why I don't sell cars because I, even if I just went and put a used tire on there, I would have a decent tire. Nobody wants to buy something with bald tires. I mean like, wonder if it even make it tires because that's what's on the front of this thing. I mean, that's why I don't sell cars though. That's exactly why I'm not in the car business. I drive my cars until they are done. I do the same thing. Lord, I can't, like, my gold truck ain't running right now. <sighs> like, ain't it just like, supposed to make you happy, not me. I'm telling you. I remember when I was young and dumb and I bought my first wife a boob job and you'd think that would make you happy. It did not. Made her happy. Made my friends happy, but it did not make me happy. I shouldn't have said that. I take that back. Um, I'm just saying. I was happy with little bitty itty bitties. It didn't matter to me. I mean, whatever man ever complained about that anyhow. Moving right along. You know, I said all that just to say that I don't enjoy. I, I don't know. I just don't enjoy. I mean, they had that parked in there like nobody's business. <clears throat> I feel the same way about this as I did that, that woman driving me talking about there's lights in the mirrors that let you know if somebody's there. <laughs> yeah. Let me go ahead and completely pass on all that. Uh, I, and if you do that, please, for the love of tiny people, please don't, uh, don't count on that. Um, 
little light in that rear view mirror never going out to promise you there's not somebody there. Can you see how much I trust this mirror? This, uh, can you tell how much I trust this backup camera? And the man's looking out the window talking about, dang, he's parking it back in the spot. Yeah, brother man, I am. There's a lifted Chevy. That's hello to all the problems you're having now. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take me a little, I'm gonna take me a little decline on that. Uh, if you don't doubt, leave it out. Just, oh my gosh, y'all funny to me. Y'all some funny rascals. <laughs> One more time, hold on. I mean, get her done. That's when, and I ain't gonna lie, that air conditioner be important. This is like prom night. Do we gotta leave? <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe it ain't like that. I just say. Can you take me higher? Oh, yeah, I can't be forgetting my phone. I kind of. <sighs> that was good while it lasted, girl. See what I mean? Look at that. She's nice, but... Hey, it was smooth. Yeah, I seen another GMC over here when I drove around. Which one it is? Somewhere right in here. Oh yeah. yeah. This is a 14? Yeah, 14. It's a Z71 two-wheel drive. This is 40,000 miles on it. So this is two-wheel? Yes, sir. Cloth. Are they all locked? No, they lock some of them. Sometimes leave them unlocked. They're supposed to be locked, though. Of course, I can get to any one of them. This one, it's a decent old truck. I mean, I think the other one you just drive a little bit cleaner. But, you yeah. Know, comparable. You know, same, close to the same miles and whatnot. <sighs> old Black Betty. <laughs> it's big. Is this the one y'all pull with, or is it for sale, too? No, this one's for sale. So, is, we just got it in. Is uh, it 7-3? 6-0. 6-0. Yeah, it's a Chevy. Yeah, it's a Chevy. Almighty, you better run now. <laughs> yeah, they... I had one of them that cost me an entire fortune. They got a recommendation. That's what I say, recommendation. Stay away from them. <laughs> 
That's I've heard some people say they had great service out of them. Well, when they do that thirty thousand dollar overhaul on it, it's yeah. They they are good trucks. Yeah, that has been bulletproof lead and all that stuff. Dodge, but it, I don't mind a Ram. Decent old truck. That one's a 13 model. It is a little mile I think it's got like 220 on the miles. Yeah. Uh, Free pad four wheel drive. Well, I about need four door and about need four wheel drive. Four wheel drive definitely comes in handy. Even if you don't need it all the time, you might need it sometimes. Yeah. Nissan. Yes, 17 model Titan. Free cab, four wheel drive, 158,000 miles or so. Man, you know your info, don't you? Wayne's buddy actually owns something. You know Ray Ford? Yeah, I do. He owns this one for a little while. Traded in on the Spurs. I know it's pretty well taken care of. <laughs> So what's the one with the ones in the fence back there? What's the deal with them? I mean, they're mostly this older, high mileage, I mean, stuff of that nature, personally. You got any four-wheel drive, four-door back there? Two extended cab F 150s, like 2010 and an 07 model. Oh, there's a Tundra. Yeah, that's a, I think that was a 07 model Tundra. Got a 4.7 in it. I think it's two wheel drive truck. Oh. Services. I can't remember off the top of my head. Yeah. I don't believe I ever seen four pinstripes. <laughs> Ford, I'm good at working on them. That's what I got. Oh, I definitely agree. They they all tear up eventually. What about that 250 over there? That's another 6.0 truck. Now that one is completely stock. It hasn't been done anything to it, so it's either a really good one or a ticking time bomb, I guess. Yeah, I, I'm telling you, I done did the 6.0 thing. That's, Wayne, like, he really owes me, too. <laughs> he, he, it's my fault, but he got me real good one time. Oh, Lord. I traded an F-350 for a Chevy Tahoe. Like a, like the F-350 had a tool bed, a reading tool bed, like it was nice traded in titles and that Tahoe was four door like it wasn't worth nothing but you know I needed I had a 
family and I needed room and I get it. It happens he, that way sometimes. He didn't even drive it. What's that? What's I said that? I need a family vehicle. And he's like, I trade you titles and we done it right then. <laughs> But you do what you got to do. Shoot the lake. That's a, Dooley. That's a 90 model. 454 in it. Now that's a nice Ford there now. Yeah, it's a decent old truck. It's 13 model. Like 228 on the miles. Uh, it's got 3.5 EcoBoost in it. Mm. What did they say about the EcoBoost, huh? I mean, truthfully, I don't see a whole lot good about them. You want my truthfulness? Well, I always but, want your truthfulness. But I have. I mean, I've seen several have, three, have 300,000 miles that run just as good, and I've seen some of them have 150,000 miles and need motors. So, I mean, it's, it's kind of a toss-up, I guess. I know they're real common to have uh, about for a gasket leak. Yeah. Well, that's a nice-looking truck. Yeah, they're good-looking trucks. I can't take that from them. I've always been more of a Chevy guy myself, so I'm a little biased. Don't get me wrong. But yeah. I'm, as I know it. You said that's got the 6.0 in it. Yes, sir. Really good running driving truck. Like, it's, like I said, I mean, it's yeah. 200,000 miles on a bone stock 6.0. Well, any, any motor that bankrupt forward, <laughs> I mean, here's your sign. And and they did bankrupt. They was bought out. That Like, they was redeemed. Yeah, they stepped in and covered their loss. Definitely wasn't their best motor. They're plenty strong and pull whatever you want to them out of running. It's just a lot of running. And keeping them running. But I give you got something with your number on it. <laughs> you know what I'm looking for, sir? So if you see something or find something, just message me because I'm looking. If you got a certain uh, budget or anything you want to see here? It's, it's basically, if it's what I'm looking for. Look at that four-wheel drive. Got some decent mileage. Yeah, I don't want nothing all wore out. Don't really matter what brand for us. I ain't really sold on a brand. I just, I just want a good miles, good price. Something I ain't got to, every time I drive it to town, work on it. <laughs> but I don't want nothing new. That narrows it down, don't it? <laughs> matter if it's diesel gas burner you... uh it don't that don't really matter this is two wheel drive ain't it yeah there it is 08 model got a lot of miles it's got 302,000 miles woo she's still kicking it seems to be pretty well taken care of but it's got miles put on somebody ordered every chrome piece they sold oh yes <laughs> Down the road, I promise. <laughs> <sighs> ah, man. You got something to write with? Just grab me your card. That way I better get a hold of you. Welcome to the... Let's get in the country boy ride now. Yeah. You got your number so I get 
get something you like, I'll give you a car. Yeah, man, let, just let me know, because... Well, I'm going to buy some stuff today. I don't know what he might bring back, but I got something I think he might use for you. Yeah, you go check it out. All right. Well, I appreciate it, brother. Thank you, sir. Your honesty and everything. That goes a long way. Come back and see it. Even though the car salesman get a bad wreck. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, brother. Have a good day. Hey, you got my number, don't you? Yes, I do. Got it the phone. Hey, text me the price on that GMC so I'll have it. Thank you. Okay. Yes. <sighs> We're gathered here today. Way up in person, ain't we? Well, hello there. I was zoomed in like a champ. Good thing about that truck I was driving, it had an iPad holder built in. Can you believe it? I couldn't. I was like, Yalamalashi. <laughs> Come on, girl. I know you old, but get, get with it with the air conditioning. Come on, girl, make me, make me proud. <sighs> make me proud. Bye, Harley. <laughs> Even grow a Fu Manchu. It's a great day to be alive. The sun's still shining when I close my eyes. It's a hundred times in the neighborhood. Your every day be just as good. I'm tired of you. Desperately howling at the moon. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Oh, that's nice. Just keep swimming. <sighs> that was the Toyota dealership. Just keep swimming. Day. Yeah, I'm gonna pay this. That, hey, a good thing about, what y'all laughing about? Uh, so the good thing about that guy that I was at first with, uh, Dublin Auto Sales, like, they've been in business 52 years, like, that man, that man moves cars like he, I mean, I know he's making, he's making a killing, but, you know, he, he don't, he don't screw people over or he wouldn't be in business 52 years. I mean, I'm obviously, you know, sometimes stuff happens, but, and the deal I made on my truck with him, that's my fault. Because he didn't, I was really, I was younger. I was younger and like, I had a two door, I had a one door work truck, which I worked to make money out of, but I didn't really, 
didn't have a family car at the time. It was, man, like, it's crazy what we've been through in life. If you can just think back on stuff you've done and you like, should have had a V8. <laughs> I got several of them times, them moments going on. Uh, so, so I don't guess it's like a secret, but like they wanted twenty thousand for that truck. Uh, but like they called my granddaddy's old friend, but he's sick. He wasn't there, but they called him. And he said, like, let me have it for 15.5, which is, that's a pretty big discount just for a phone call, but um, we just keep on swimming right now. We just keep on swimming. Brian retracted his message. What on earth could you have said that you'd had to retract it? Hate I missed that one. <laughs> he's like, he's like, in his entire life, have I ever seen him retract the statement? I mean, it must have been rough, you know? Uh, <laughs> oh, man, you know? What on earth? What do we do? He said too much, brother. Oh, uh, well, that sounds about right. Oh, too much for the truck? Well, I know I want to find one about like I'm driving now, like. I pay $4,200 for this diesel four-door dually with air conditioning. That's winning. That's like you don't even have to take it by your friend to show it to him kind of deal. Like, like it was so good of a deal. Like, Like I pulled out $2,000, gave it to the man. I said, look, I got to run over here a minute. I'll be right back. So, yeah. That's the kind of deal I'm looking for. Like a deal where you can live and not get skin up in the process. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Who want to get skin up? Not me. I don't want to get skin up. I still want to go out and eat Mexican three times a week because that's winning. If you don't like a little Latina in your life, I just don't know if we can be friends. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I mean, I like guacamole. What can I say? <laughs> and I like barbecue nachos, but who's, you know, who's keeping up? Let me just tell you that the sun is getting her done today. So what we're we looking for today is a unicorn. We're looking for a unicorn. A unicorn is that rare find that nobody knows about but you. Uh, uh, when you see it, it's like, you hear a little rachacha music, you know what I'm saying? We're kind of looking for the rachacha band uh, fine, and I ain't fine, you know. <laughs> I mean, like, Maybe I oversold it, but you know what I'm saying. 
man, I wish we had a like a restaurant around here that you could. <sighs> that was beautiful. I ain't even been to lie. That's Chevrolet place. Woo! That baby was sexy. We're gonna keep swimming. Just keep swimming. I ain't even looking over there anymore. Just keep swimming. <laughs> hey, one thing we got a lot of here. De car dealerships, banks, and uh, gas stations, motels, uh, and plenty of Dollar Generals. We we have that. I mean, like, for all your needs, you can find a Dollar General at every three miles. Winning. <sighs> Makes me aggravated, like, when you're trying to find something. I just don't like the whole process. I, this is the deal. I don't like all the nagging you got to do with like the salesman. I don't like all that. First of all, you automatically know they're going to come down on the price. I just don't like the whole process of like I just don't like that whole process. I wish there's a car dealership that went ahead and put the prices on the car. Like, you don't even need a salesman. There's the price right there. Get you some of that. Now that's winning, you know. That would be winning. But nobody does that. You know, maybe like, that's something. Like there's no chance in it happening for me, but you know, oh, that's pretty. <sighs> okay, so we at the fold place. Come on, it'll pull in anything. She bad. She pretty bad. Let's see here. Super do yeah, that's too new. I ain't even gotta get a price check on that. Oh. even see anything I can afford. <laughs> I mean like where's the used car section? Where's like I don't even see nothing to get a price on. Like I can't afford none of this. test drive. Yeah, for why? Because, like, that ain't happening. That's winning, though. That's not happening. Now, that baby there is used. That's, oh, that's a power stroke. That's, like, kind of what I'm driving here, but not a dude. Oh, it's four-wheel drive. Yeah, that's, like, Don't 
tell you now, that's like... That GMC four-wheel drive out of my price range too. This and him be, I guarantee you, this and him be winning to a 12, yeah. Automatic, tan, leather, 80,000 miles. 7F254 with the O12. No price. And it's locked. I mean, like goodness. That's nice, but that's too much. Hey, when you drive something like this, the salesman don't even come out. <laughs> I mean, they sitting in there inside their little office and they seeing this truck drive around out here and they like, yeah, who wants this guy? I'm gonna pass. That's winning. That happens. I'm telling you right now that happens. The only reason, the only reason the other guy come out is because I called in there and asked for Wayne. <laughs> That's true. Like, and they like, oh, he's like, oh crap, he knows the owner. Let me go out here. But like me riding around in my truck, y'all seen me. I was out there for 15 minutes and nobody come outside. I love that. Here's a little song I wrote. Why don't you sing it note for note? Don't worry. Be happy. Woo-hoo. Don't worry, be happy. <laughs> Man, I can't, I'm sorry, like. I can't help it, like, that I know is that's exactly what's going on. I'm sorry that I know that. Going back silent, okay. All right, oh, look at him. This is a brand new fleet, like, woo! Business is good. Business is looking good. Here's a little song I wrote. Why don't you sing it note for note? Don't worry. Be happy. <laughs> I can't help it. That's just what comes to me. No, and nobody in the whole entire Ford dealership walked out because of my truck so old. <laughs> I can't help it. Look, everybody might have had Taco Bell that you know. They're more than likely just all in the commode right now. We're finna go to the Chevrolet place and we can go ahead and test the theory again on the old truck. <laughs> I think that's hilarious myself. There's another pole man in our parking lot. Look, I'm, I'm rich in Jesus. That's funny. Who thought, who knew we'd had this much fun riding around looking for unicorns? We just need to find one unicorn is all, just one. 
Where is she at? Looking for a unicorn. Sorry, I got it out of the way. I feel much better now. <laughs> like I was struggling for a second. Wait a minute. I thought I was done. It's coffee is what it is. Let's see if there's any unicorns here. This is the Chalet place. Even though that's a Ford. I wonder if they'll get right because it's a Ford. I know y'all don't sell them. Ooh, look at that bad mama jamma hammer. That's definitely out of the budget budget. I don't even have a budget. That's why when that man asked me what was my budget, I was like, what budget? I don't have one. I just want a good deal. Like, I just want like, who said? I don't like talking budget. What I like to talk in is, is walking through the front door in your black drip. Are you kidding? This is what I'm, they got the prices on them. 62,000, what? For that? 48,000, 48, no I read I told y'all, why don't they just put the prices on the trucks? And that's a sign. That means I can show enough keep swimming. 38,000. 38,000. That's the prime numbers around here. 39, 43, 29. Where's like, where's the country boy section? 48,000. There's a GMC. Look at that. That's high as giraffe duty. But look at it. Whew. Good gracious look. I bet they don't have the ticker's price on that. Look at this Bronco now. Okay, okay. Oh, that's a 2023. I ain't even got to look at that anymore. No wonder it's pretty. It ought to be. That's because it's brand stank new. $51,000? Are you kidding? Yeah, I done got in the wrong area. Where's the... Where's the other area? I gotta keep swimming. Somebody jamming. <sighs> yeah, that's a little hot. see nothing but new stuff. Where's the where is the used section? You gotta admit now GMC is a pretty mamma jamma. <laughs> Guess what y'all don't see behind me? A salesman. <laughs> I can't make it up, baby. Can't make it up.
they probably like, oh, that's that unicorn guy. Don't worry about him. I ain't even seen nothing in my, I ain't even seen nothing in there. I, yeah. Yeah, that was a big negative. That's if you want a brand new car. Come on down here. Y'all think I'm playing about like driving an old vehicle and they go on ahead and like summon you up right then. How many times are we gonna have to pull into a dealership and prove that? Yes, we're just keeping on swimming. Y'all, y'all ever, <laughs> y'all ever watched poor people shot before? Well, welcome to the show today. <laughs> that air conditioning is winning. Somebody just said something about a million dollars. I missed that whole message. Dang it. Dang it. Say it. Let me see what it says. I had no idea, I think he was paid cash. Some inherited money when my granddaddy papa passed a hundred thousand dollars since. Wow. Woo! That's more zeros than I ever seen. I mean, I just want to drive around with the sun out of my eyes. That's what I want to do. Oh, I got to get y'all back onto the charger. Are we like, I got to keep an eye on time too. One o'clock. It's all right to be little bitty. Little hometown or a big old city. Might as well laugh, might as well smile. Life goes on for a little bit of while. Y'all hear Hollywood say how he bought his truck? He said he's seen it online. He's seen a picture of it online and his little girl wanted it. So he called him and said, Get me a good interest rate and a tank of gas and call me when it's ready. I was like, Woo! That's winning. I mean like. Woo! You know? That's what I'm talking about. Make it happen, Captain. <laughs> I mean, no. Yee. That just. Finding his own. He made his own unicorn. So, if you just tuning in, got to tell you this. Even though I know I'm not going to find anything I'm looking for at a car lot, I'm still looking. Um, I signed a contract with an electrician yesterday. We got the ball rolling. So, you know. 
know, maybe things is looking up in the direction of let's get back to building a house. Man, I'm telling you, like, the electricity side of it has just, like, put a whooping on me. Uh, it has put a whooping on me, like, just finding people that have come and show up and come back and You know, I, you know, my daddy says I don't never sweat nothing. He said, you don't never sweat nothing. Look at him. Look at old glory. He says, you never sweat nothing. And I mean, I guess I really don't. I just don't worry about it. I mean, I really don't worry about it. Like, man, you can sit around and worry about stuff and then to just eat at you like cancer. Like, I just, I just don't think about it. I have, I was born to, with the ability to not just worry. I don't know. I just don't worry about it. Like, I, I prayed about the electrician. Like, I knew I was just doing show after show after show, not working on the house, but not. What do you do, you know? What do you do if you had a standstill? Like, like, I've had thousands of people talking about, you're not building a house anymore? Yeah, I am, really. I'm just, like I am, I just at a standstill, and I didn't understand why. But I didn't question it. I didn't doubt it. I didn't get depressed about it. You know, I just, I just let what happened happen and, you know, I just waited on the Lord to send the right person. And he sent the right person. And like, he sent that unicorn. And like, just knew. Well, I bought him a biscuit and ain't never met him. I don't know, it's just like we knew. I knew. Like, you just know. And like, it just clicked, you know? Alright, welcome to the Dodge dealership. Alright. Now I joke a lot, you know. I joke around a lot, but I really do gotta find the used car section. Man, I don't know why, but them GMCs is pretty. And look at that American flags in the back. I ain't found her yet, but man! And that Ram looking tough too, look at it. I ain't bull jiving. Woo, that 2500 is stinking right there now. Hey. But it's just too much money, you know? Somebody want to buy my truck if I park it right here. Into the used car section. We're going to park into the used car section. I can plow a field all day long. I can catch catfish from a dusty old dawn. If you don't have a, if you don't have this, a battery charger, a fillet knife, all like under your feet, we might can't be friends. You know, I'm just saying. We might can't be friends.
Man, that's pretty, but that's too much money, I can tell you. Ain't in no need to look like it's just nice. That's got the hemi in it. Woo, that's pretty, it's red. There's a white Dodge and that's clean. That's clean right there now. Yo. That's clean. Well, that truck could do anything you need it to do right there, baby. That's like too much money too. I need to find the older stuff. That's a 16 F-250. Baby, right there is sexy, but it's just too much. Oh, not a blacked out one. You better watch out. That's nice, ain't it? Mm. So that's a 2022. Yeah, we can keep swimming. No wonder it's nice. <laughs> you know, no wonder. A Ram, Lariat, Laramie, Diesel. That's a bad mamma jamma right there. Dodge. Chevrolet. Oh, that's a King Ranch. Gracious, let me help you out with that girl. I know that's bothering you right there. I'm sorry. Oh, you feel better already, don't you? Look at that stinking mamma jamma. What did this what's the saying? Don't hurt to look. 2019 F250. Yeah, I had to keep swimming on that, but it's pretty though. That's got the deer mauler up on the front of it, so, uh, yeah. I mean, this is just blister whatever you can find. There's a Titan. Yeah, that's, that kind of looks more of my price range, but I, like, I don't really like a Titan. <laughs> Tundra. Maybe I'll get done with this coffee slash hash brown or whatever it is that I'm dealing with right now. Oh, that baby's pretty inside. That's winning. 2016 Toyota Tundra. I we'll found a car dealership that actually got them unlocked. 93,000 miles. Man, you can smell the cleanness in this bad mamma jamma. Woo! Got the sunroof. Yeah, like. That's winning. That's nice. And it's a Toyota. Damn. Two wheel drive. That'll be two-wheel drive all day. 
Oh, it's got an oil leak. Well, that don't necessarily mean oil leak. That some kind of leak. When the lights go out in the city, oh, they got some campers. And the rain comes pouring down. I told y'all, when you drive a piece of hockey, the salesman ain't having it. They don't want to waste their time because it's kind of hot out here. That's like, look like a transformer. That's winning. Oh, and it's got the F-150, like flag symbols in it. Woo. Now at this point, we're just looking at what year it is. Thirty-three thousand miles. Yeah, we don't even have to worry about what year it is. Yeah, we're gonna have to pass on that. Gracious, that's some big old rims. Woo! What is this? This is a Dodge. Looks like. Oh, that's a Ram. Got a big old den in it. Man, that tire just looks so wet. Like, I gotta touch it. Oh, that's like they just sprayed that on there to, like a few minutes ago. Like it's a warner, they still ain't out here somewhere. Yeah, this is like bringing back memories. That ain't no boot. That's a serious business. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> ain't no boot to go out on this mama jamma. I mean, did they mud bog in it, you reckon? Get under them and look. If it's got an oil leak, they did a good job at like fixing it or covering it up. I don't see no transmission leaks. You know what? This has got written all over it. I bet this mother get 10 miles to the gallon. Somebody, somebody welded that. Somebody got tired of that getting out of... I bet it, I bet this thing rides rough. Might be wrong, but. That's a Dodge. Look, Bill Ford already coming out. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna take that as a sign. 
billfold already done fell out my pocket. That's a big old dodge, yo. Nobody wants to sell a vehicle to the little old bitty man. This stuff's real nice. I mean, these vehicles are like really nice. I wonder how much they want for that. <laughs> That's winning. Old Betsy. I parked in a mud hole. That's probably why nobody parked in. <sighs> Ain't that America? You and me, ain't that America? What it is. Good to see y'all in my video doing something a little different.
that America, you and me, ain't that America, land of the free. Tell you what. Just keeping, we just keeping on swimming right now. I can't keep up with all this going on. Trash is rough. Yeah, come on, cross there, man. In your GMC. 
Let's win it. Ain't that America? Home of the free. Little pink house, you and me. They got a BMW. They got another BMW. They got a station wagon. Oh my goodness, now I didn't see that. Woohoo! <laughs> I mean, like nobody said nothing about the station wagon. Now that's a pretty Ford he didn't say nothing about. See, some of this looks like in my price range, but then some of it don't. It's like when it's all beat up, it's like, yeah. Yeah, now that's nice how much for that one. But like when it looks good, it's like, yeah, that's probably gonna be too much. That's kind of how it goes. That's a dodge. Mama said don't never make a decision on the empty stomach. Might have to go buy a banana split. Ain't that America for you and me? Ain't that America land of the free? Let's come on back here to the, let's come on back here to the dissension. At least this hand, you know what you get. I mean a Cadillac. You better watch out, son. That's got the North Star in it. They want nothing beer to touch at around here. This whole thing wrong way. Whoa. Whoa. That's a CTS, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. Need to get that out here on the highway and open that mamma jamma up. You better watch out. And it's got rims on it. <sighs> Whew. I mean, like, if that won't spin a wheel, we need to go home. Look at that little Honda car. I bet that thing can drive a million miles. Them are pretty good. Them are pretty good. Uh, oh, that's an E320 class. Like, you can go and break out your checkbook when something tears up on that mama jamma. Look at that old dog sitting there. This vehicle is not for sale. Doggone it, look at it. It's a Toyota four door. I was like, I ain't seen that. Four wheel drive, I hadn't seen that. Guess what, it's not for sale. What in the world? Doggone it.
don't it? Well, I guess it's for a reason. <laughs> Woo! Look out, girl. I see you. You bad rascal. What's going on here? What we got going on here? Now, that's nice. That's like a really nice truck to be back in. Wonder what sells it. A 16. That baby drives smooth. Ain't no bull jiving going on around here. We got winners. We got losers. Smokers and losers, and we got. I think this truck is like Austin's. She's got a den in her. You can wheel and deal when they den it up. <laughs> Yay! That one's got too many. That been mauled up right here. Yeah, I'm gonna, we're gonna have to pass on that. Setting back here into the, this is back here where And the city, and the rain comes pouring down. In the city, oh. Yeah, baby. I mean, we're looking for a unicorn, but I don't think that's it. <laughs> that's funny, though, ain't it? Oh, that's them, that's them $230 tires right there. I'm going to get you some of them. King Ranch Foldo four-wheel drive. Exactly, why lock it? That's what I was thinking. It got the deer getter on it. It ain't dented up. Not yet. Synthetic motor oil. You know what that means? That ain't good. That means just right off the bat, uh, like it smokes. And if you run synthetic in it, 
it won't smoke because synthetic oil don't it burns clear I'm gonna say that's a big 10-4 Is anybody having flashbacks? Yeah. This is like oil leak like a champ. Two hundred and sixty-nine thousand miles. Tell him what he's won, Johnny. I bet this has had more trouble than Jesus. DVD player. Well, that's nice, but <laughs> got rear air. And that's a ton of miles, though.
I try. Alright. This is King Ranch out here by the back corner of the fence. We got a price on it. Gotta go to the transmission shop. Uh, reverse is acting up. Like, I was just curious anyway for the price. That's a lot of miles. I don't know why when I see a station wagon out there. I can't think of nothing funner to do than get a station wagon and do a burnout. <laughs> like, what is it about a Volkswagen? It ain't even a Volkswagen. What is it about a station wagon that'll look funny spinning a wheel? Like, Greatest, ain't it? Yeet. Chevrolet, they notorious for the tailgate handles breaking. That's an extra cab forward, but not four door. What do we have here? Courtesy of the red, white, and blue. It's got a den in it. Number one gangster, word it up. Oh, like it like that. That's a pretty forward right there, but like, oh, it's high mileage. I mean, it's bad when the vehicles I have have less miles. Like, this is a 7.3 diesel. It has 213,000 miles, like, that is nothing for a diesel engine. I mean, like, it's bad to say, but, like, it's just getting broke in. You know, don't look at the battery light. That's been on since I bought it. Man, I never noticed that it was that dusty. The old girl's been a good one, ain't she? Blame it all on my roots. Showed up in booze. Ruined your black tie fair. Last one to know on the show. Last one you thought you'd see there. I saw it's bright. Feel high. Ice on a glass of champagne. Yeah, we toasted. Look! It's... It's brand new. 
<laughs> I mean, we can just go on home now, can't we? I toasted you, say honey, we made me through. You'll never hear me complain. Well, I got friends in low places where the whiskey drowns and the beer chases my blues. You gotta say, that's a clean truck. I'll be okay Yeah, I'm not big on souls Praises think I slip on down To the U.S. So I got friends In local places Boating little ride. That's one of them Toyotas. Man, they ain't got this built for big trucks, I can tell you that much. Lord. Oh, that's close. That's like if you was the owner, you'd be like here looking at me right now. Oh, that's close, baby. That's tighter than an Alabama tick. <laughs> yeah! There are no places where the whiskey drowns and the beer chases my blues away. Well, I'll be okay. Yeah, I'm not big. On souls drink and think I slip on down to the old west. So I got friends in low places. Come on over here, man. Come on over here. Should have had the camera turned the other way. He slung everything on the dash into the floorboard. I've done that a time or two in my life. I got friends in long places. Bounce down, 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 I've been there before. The last one, the last one to show you were the last one I thought you'd see there. Saw in her eyes. I hear a glass of champagne. I said. Ivory Tower that you live in. Well, I got friends that low places where the whiskey drowns and the bear chases my parents away. I just riding around like seeing a seeing a old grandpappy's best friend from the light back in the day gonna pull through. I bet these people behind me is tired of me. Let me just get, let me just get going here. My God, friends, at long places.
Cause I got friends in the places where the whiskey drowns and the beer chases my blue way. Now be okay. Yeah, I'm not big on some drink and think I slip on down to the old west zone. I got friends in low places. So I seen a truck when I was test driving a while ago. I seen a truck sitting here. Chevrolet, four wheel drive, four door. A 05 Chevy Silverado Z71 190K on body. Newer 5.3 motor. Morton camshaft, stainless steel, mag, plow, exhaust, 12,000. That means like a 190K on body means it's had a motor put in it. Even though it says new 5.3 motor, like I don't know if that means like new. Don't exactly mean new. I'm saying new could mean junkyard motor, or new could mean crate motor. Like if it's a crate motor, like that's fine. Like if. Because you can buy crate motors for them. Thank you for that super chat. I missed who sent that. Thank you so much. Mighty sweet of you. Two forty 
three heads, cam. Still like a daily driver, isn't it? Yeah. Just uh, sounds good. Been doing all right, bro. Yeah. Working hard, ain't you? Probably copyrighted my whole video. That's winning. Let's see. Heck, man, I want to drive it. Probably need to get my truck out of the road. Yeah, pull it in here. Just pull it back up right here. Like I said, I bought it, put all that shit on it. I was going to drive it every day, then I fucked around it. Bought me a high country Duramax, and I got my Tacoma I drive every day, so I was like, shit, this gonna Oh, that's you? Yeah. It's got a silver truck right here. Not the four hundred. Oh, yeah. Over. I meant to say that don't fit you. Oh, that's my little nephew. <laughs> oh, that's yeah. Water. All right, brother. Okay. God, dog, I thought I had the camera facing the truck the whole entire time. It was on me. Lord, I'm sorry. Hey, I didn't realize I was... I don't know why in the crap. I had it facing me. I don't even think y'all seen the truck. Still ain't facing the truck. Yeah, he he said he bought a brand new a brand new engine from the Chevrolet place and put in it. So what he said.
trying to see about the air conditioner. The miles is 193,000, but uh, if it's got a brand new, and I asked him, you know, I asked him was it when he said new motor, does he mean like junkyard motor or like dealership motor? And he said it was new from the dealership, like a brand new engine. So. Chevrolet. It's clean, you know. Leather seats. from my Corvette engine in my car like my motor is new uh, I have like 60 pound of oil pressure
right, that should be four low. Uh, it's got a battery light on. I don't, I don't understand about that, but it's got bolts. The bolts are the bolts are good, uh, even though the battery lights on. Whatever the air done, it hadn't done it again. It, it like stopped blowing cold for a minute. But it's getting her done right now. So, um, so somebody look up this for me. 2005 Chevy Silverado 1500 Z71. Somebody looked that up.
and the air conditioner is getting a done. Yeah, 2005 Chevy Silverado uh, with the five point. Yeah, 5.3 engine. Country boy estimation. <laughs> So you can kind of say like it's it's nice, so it's kind of on the uh, oh they put a pipe in here. That's cause the swamp overran. Okay, I appreciate it. Never had my own hair in my mouth.
Yeah, they they are asking twelve thousand for this. with a free back window sticker. Yeah, it does, don't it? Might have been playing.
planet. Yeah, you can do it in there. This is America. You can do anything you want to do. Including long test drives. Oh. Well, the, hey, the air is still freezing cold. Man, that's great. that America home of the free ain't that America you and me
right smooth. Shifts very good. It ain't lagging or drawed out or jumping. Well, that's her.
I think Donaldson, he, when he came back and dropped the bracket off, I, I said, Dusty's got your number, right? And he said, no, nobody's got my number. I said, if you don't mind, go in and tell the secretary your name and number. Yeah. yeah. Man, it's it shifts good, don't it? Yeah, I think it's good. He said, I got it as a better driver and end up buying that damn high pressure gear match. Yeah. Everybody got it. It's us. Call mama. I bet your mama's got it. Did, did that guy have any paperwork on the motor? Yeah. You know Josh Clark? Yeah. That's where he comes from. Oh, okay. I mean, is it any kind of warranty on it? That's why I guess what yeah, I'm asking. Yeah, sure. Yeah, because they bought it brand new. Yeah. 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 Is, is it yours or his? No, it's mine. Okay. I hadn't even, it's the title, I got the title in there. I hadn't even uh, swapped it. Stroker, but I bought I bought it with all the bells and whistles with a warranty. So you can give it you know what and it's still covered. <laughs> they, they they pretty much uh they went on one of them one of the places you kinda of order like you want. It was a brand new five three short block and then they went with two forty three heads, which is a stock LS head, but it's the good ones. Yeah. And then went with cam motion yeah. cam and then Different cam, he went with the good springs for that cam. So he sent me, like I said, a purchase order from us. Yeah. Ten for brother. Well, I'll be in touch. Okay. Yeah. I appreciate it. Yeah, you just want me to ask you if you guys dropped the number off. Yeah, so they do got paperwork on the motor. He didn't have it, but like it's available. take her a minute to get that cooled off. <sighs> so what have we accomplished today? I think that yellow car yeah, I ain't seeing all the comments. I apologize, y'all. Uh, I really ain't seeing them all. Man, that 
truck sounded good. Got a good exhaust, good strong motor, new tires, but it's like priced at the very. I was showing y'all the truck and y'all can't see nothing. Like, ain't that great? I'm sorry, y'all. I'm trying to do better. But the only problem is this, like, man, they asking, like, way above what Blue Book on it is. Only thing. Even if they take, uh, even if they take 8,500, like that's still, like that's still right up there, like at about the most them year models are worth. I didn't, <laughs> I didn't even want to insult the guy by telling him 8,500. But it's like if I go to sell my truck, uh, you know, I bought the truck, put rims and tires on it, I put four sets of tires on it, I put two transmissions, I put alternators, starters, front dry shafts, rear ends, like I probably got I easily probably got $17,000 in a truck that ain't worth $6,000. So like, it's got all that lift, it's got all that suspension, like, you know, that's how it goes. You know, no matter what you put into something, that's what you can get out of it. You know, it did, he said it does got a new engine, but he said it's got 5,000 miles on it, so. Or he said probably 5,000 miles. Please hit the like and share. Yeah, please do that. Like and share. They're paving that. A little, a little sticky down there onto the road.
thank goodness for air conditioner. Like, look, fat people can't make it without air conditioning. <laughs> I, I mean, to be perfectly honest, I ain't seen too many small people make it without air conditioner either. I don't know how a lot of people did it back in the day, being just tough like it's a railroad iron. How to have some air conditioner. That was some beautiful blue pit puppies beside the road. Seven out of ten people will grab them if they see them. That's winning. You know? Hey, I appreciate y'all watching today. Watching me do absolutely nothing. Um, well, I did got some stuff accomplished. I figured out that I ain't found the unicorn yet. <laughs> Still looking for the unicorn out there. I'm at the store though. I need to go in and get me something to drink. Appreciate y'all watching. I'm thirsty. I ain't drank nothing. I'm finna go buy a seven up. I ain't even realized I like them. And I just realized, hey, I like them. You enjoy truck hunting? Hey, we'll do it some more. But uh, I, I'm just looking right now. Just keeping on swimming. You're gonna cave the side. I know I'm gonna buy two. Cause the first one, uh, the first one I get, I'm gonna go on and blister it. I am gonna cave the side in. And then I'm gonna get me a second one that I can sip on. But yeah, I'm, I'm like pretty dry mouthed. It's an emergency. I love y'all. Thank you for watching. And I'll see y'all in the next video, y'all. Alright. Get you a water too. <laughs> Alright. Bye bye.